Casey Anderson. I'm an assistant professor of English and I direct composition here at Shinar Hi, I'm Kiki Patch. I'm an assistant professor in environmental science and resource services. The, the theme of faculty really ties into what we're trying to help cultivate for the coast um, because it is so valuable. It is the thing that really defines California. Keep you often talks about the California imaginary. And this is the thing that brings people here. This is the thing that people think about when they think about California all around the world. Seeing how they're interpreting, interpreting this project in, like, in ways that I would not have thought of. Right. Um, and it, to watch it morph in this way, um, that's pretty cool. So, what you're going to be seeing are uh, kind of an interpretive piece, really looking at the threats that our sandy ecosystems are facing, whether that's trash or sea level rise, um, and offshore oil drilling, offshore yeah. oil drilling, coastal development, all of those things that are really threatening our sandy beach ecosystems. I'm really excited that um, Arts and the Stars exists and that we have a campus that really helps um, celebrate these kinds of collaborations. Hi everyone, my name is Lauren Zahn. I am the Rec Sports Assistant here at the Rec Center. And I was a former ESRM and English student here at CI. Um, this performance is actually based off of a paper that I wrote two years ago for an English class. I um, I think it's really important for people to understand all of the impacts and everything that degrades our beaches and how we can actually help, how we can be part of the solution instead of just going there and enjoying it but not really protecting it. I'm really excited to have a piece based off of my own work because it's really cool to see what I wrote down on a page come to life and see how it's interpreted by other people. Um, so this dance performance is a really good interpretation of what I wrote and it really gives you a visual of what's happening in the present and then what could happen in the future to our beaches. So I think that's really important for people to see and I hope that you guys will love this performance.
critters navigating through the water and the coast, interacting in their underwater society, weaving around each other in a colorful display, dancing traffic, searching for food. A turtle swoops down to catch a fish, but instead catches a straw in its nostril. A floating trail of the turtle's blood grows behind him as he endures the pain and continues to hunt as best he can. Their world poses no threat to ours, yet ours does to theirs. We ignorantly dump hazards in their habitats out of convenience when a trash isn't nearby. The coast deserves our tender consideration. It's full of such rich life, life that can't coexist with litter. Critters dying by our apathetic laziness. If the world holds such beauty, may we no longer strip it away with our ugly waste. Let us coexist with the coast. Coexist with the coast by Garrett Rodriguez.